Hello, this is a video about Kazeta, a multi-purpose UREC module inspired by real-to-real -real tape machines. It simulates magnetic hysteresis to provide warm tape-like saturation, it has four independent delay lines that can be used to create rhythms or feedback loops, it offers wow and flutter control, stereo output and much more. You can find more information about all of its features, technical details and tutorials in the manual linked in the description. So let's get started by plugging in some sound input. I will be using accordion as a basic VCO. And once it is connected, I will use the preamp knob to control the loudness. If I set it too high, the display will indicate clipping. Moving on to the saturation, it is controlled through three knobs, dry wet blending between the clean and saturated signal and bias with drive, which affect the character of the effect. I will turn the wet attribute to the max and scroll through the bias range. And now I will scroll through the drive. The last knob in the column controls wow and flutter. At its center position, these effects are disabled. Turning it to the right dials in the flutter effect, causing abrupt momentary changes of the pitch. Turning the knob closer to the center softens the effect. Finally, turning it to the left enables wow, causing slow fluctuation of the pitch. The delay of Kazeta is based around four reading heads, each with its own position, volume, feedback and panning control. What we hear now is the first head playing the input signal immediately as it comes in. Let's increase the volume of the second head and delay its position. Now I will introduce the third head. And by shifting positions of these heads, we can create different rhythmic patterns. Each head can be positioned in the stereo output using the pan and all. The speed knob controls the length of the delay. The maximum length is 5 minutes and it can also operate in the audio range. Feedback knobs control how much of the red signal will be written back to the input, producing an infinite echo. Turning the tone knob to the left applies the low pass filter on the input signal. Turning it above center rolls in high pass filter. The speed can also be controlled using a clock CV or by tapping in the desired tempo.
you can learn about the rest of Casita's features, such as an explosive overdrive, feedback filtering, internal oscillator or trigger sequencing, and do the manual. Thanks for watching. Thank you.